Leaf Blade for me. Wait, wait, wait. I avoided the attack. What do you mean avoided the attack? Alright everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, we'll get right into the battles. Just a couple of things. Um, if you're watching this, you're not sub. We're like four subs away from 400, so I'd really appreciate it. Uh, we're trying to get to 500 so we can get to 1,000. Um, question of the day will be on the next screen, but the question of the day will be um, which max move uh, will you miss or be happy to see go? Answer both. No skin off your back. Hit the notifications because my videos don't always get pushed to you guys. And I just want to thank you guys for your continued support. And we'll get right into the battles. I don't see, though, what just stops me from going with right you or doesn't center feel better here center does feel better um clops glastrier and feeny well feeny negs a lot of this list <laughs> feeny absolutely negs a lot of this list i like my beard <laughs> Don't forget question of the day. Which max move will you miss or or no 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 which max move will you miss and which max move will you be happy to see gone? That's what I want to know. Also, okay, about to say which Pokemon are they gonna pick? Cause they're taking forever. Homie Taki. I hope I'm saying that right. Good luck, have fun. You know the drill. Let me uh, get up in the camera for you guys. Darmanitan Butterfree. Okay, so they got compound eyes. I'm not with that. Okay, uh, so their Gorilla Tactics are going to be down one. Okay, so this is a pressure Dust Clops because it's my Players Cup team. So I need to switch it for a dust clop that has frisk. Um, I'm gonna fake out the butterfly so they can't sleep me. Um, and then I'm just gonna trick room here. Big damage. Very, very big damage. All right, so we're just gonna flare blitz right here. Um, doubling up into this feels unsafe, but I feel like I might have a sash. I feel like it's gonna have a sash. But if we may have like a scarf, you know? Okay, this is good. So we'll kill this thing. So Darm is gone. But if we can beat with anything. I'm okay with my uh let's see what they bring out my incinero going down so they just want an earthquake again right so what i'm gonna do actually is so they can't sleep my dust clops um, let's switch in the Feeny. Nightshade this thing, cause this thing can have a sash also. <laughs> and like, you gotta be worried about these focus sashes. You're like, we know it's broken on the Butterfree if it did have it. Um, and Butterfree likes to carry a choice scarf just so he can get those sleeps off. So this way, um, 
Let's see if they just earthquake, which I suspect they'll do. Yeah, our Pokemon are too strong for their Pokemon. Our Pokemon are too strong for their Pokemon. So now I just muddy water here. Um, and now Nightshade in case this thing survives. Mammoth Swine for sure goes down though. That thing is weak sauce. Watch, watch it survive and me look like a fool on camera. <laughs> They're thinking about protecting, they're thinking about switching. I want them to switch, right? So I can get free damage or whatever's in the back. Cause then it'll just have to eat. Like Butterfree can't do anything. It can't protect cause it's Scarf. Um, so it can only switch. Mamoswine could potentially protect, but like it, it still has to switch, you know? I mean, it's, it's still that the Butterfree can't do anything but Sleep Powder. So it has to switch or just eat the hit. So I'm not really sure how much I'm thinking about. Ice Shard is not gonna do anything for you here. That's kind of just a waste of a turn. I mean, I guess, you know, no, it's not a waste. You get the chip damage off because you anticipate you're gonna go down this turn. So it does make sense. I gotta take that back. They do survive. So we recover some health now. Let's see what they um what they have in the back. We know they had that darm, but that darm is dead. Uh, what is it? Charizard maybe? Maybe Charizard? They can't. They they only have one Pokemon left, so I'm not sure what exactly they're um. It's Cartana. So how many times of Trick Room do I have left? I have one. So it's really their prerogative to protect, right? Because I want to preserve the Feeny, I'm going to switch in the Incineroar because I don't really need it anymore. This thing might protect, but it might be assault vest. So let's go after it. Cartana could also be assault vest. So we'll get some good information this turn. Cause they want to protect double. They want to double protect. Really, really bad. But like, at least this way, I get the intimidate off, right? So like, their um, their Cartana's la uh, loses some attack. And now if they leave like this turn, they're gonna be really upset. Leaf blade for me. Wait, 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 Ma avoided the attack. What do they mean avoided the attack? What the hell item does that thing have? I'm not down any accuracy. Y'all are some bastards. Um, <laughs> no, screw the Feeny. Feeny's coming in to eat the um sacred sword. It's coming in to eat the sacred sword. How freaking dare they? How did I miss? How the hell does this cost Miss Nightshade? What exactly? How did I miss? So they must be earthquaking here if they, um, <laughs> they thought they could kill Incineroar. <laughs> I 
That's not enough, bro. <laughs> That's not enough, son. <laughs> Trick room me, baby. <laughs> Um, that was funny. All right, so now we are going to go for... A muddy water, because we're going to hit both. And a nightshade right here. I don't care if they kill the Feeny now, because Trick Room is back up. They are in a pickle. They are in a pickle. Oh, I missed the memo. This is totally okay. Now it's time to neg this Cartana. Absolutely gonna neg this Cartana. It's time for Glass Year, baby. Cause I think only put them at neutral. Know what I'm gonna do to him? I'm gonna get my defense boost and I'm gonna get my attack boost. And then when all hope is lost <laughs> at the plus one defense, plus one attack last year, then they will know pain. <laughs> you shall know pain. Get that thing out of here. Get him out the paint. They're gonna steal spike into me. They're lucky at our weakness policy. They lucky I'm not. I forgot that their Cartado was out of Dynamax. Oh my goodness. It's, it's about to be bad for them. Um, should I pain split? <laughs> no, I'm just gonna nightshade him. You shall no pain. <laughs> they quit. Good game to my opponent. They played very well, played very hard. Good job to them, for sure. Right shoe. Moltres and Feeny feel really good. Now, just a matter of what I want is my last mine. Um, Incineroar does hit the... A couple of these mines pretty well. I can intimidate the Gyarados, I guess, but they have two clear body mines. Does Dusclops just give me more? Yeah, because worst case scenario, I can always Trick Room. Um, Nightshade, Paint Split, Hidden Hay stuff, so... I don't think Incineroar gives me a lot in this matchup. And like, I could potentially, you know, bring the um, glass, I could like bring glass tree and try to trick room up, but like that uh, Sableye probably has taunt. So 
It's not something that's gonna get me able to just go up easily. Okay, I like this. Are they gonna max that Needle King? They might, so let's area impulse it. Let's actually airstream it because if the if the dragon ball goes for phantom force, I just waste the turn of max. And I don't want to waste the turn of max. I legit feel like what they want to do is either put up like screens or phantom force. So I don't want to waste my max turn like that. Now, if they max this needle king, that'd be awesome, right? Because we're pretty much neutralizing on turn one. So it is screens on Dragon Ball, which is great, right? Because I'll um, be faster than it next turn. It's pretty strong. I think it's strong. That's definitely Life Orb. Life Orb, uh, Life Orb and what is it, Shield Force? So they might want to protect their thing now, but like if they do, that's fine, right? Because now what I can do is I can nuzzle over here and I can just airstream again. So I have plus two speed and I'll have a dead Needle King. Once I paralyze the Dragon Ball, it'll be very, very useless going forward for the rest of the match. Don't forget that question of the day. <laughs> Speaking of maxes, which max move at all will you miss or be happy to see gone or both? Let me know in the comments. Whenever people take this long to make their moves, I'm like, man, I gotta fill this space. Okay, so something else is gonna eat an airstream. Oh, yes. Yes, eat this airstream, Gyarados. Eat airstream. So this is like perfect, right? Because now this Gyarados just eats a big hit. Bulky, bulky boy. But like, I'm gonna kill it. Good you turn out. Back to the Nero King, I presume. Ooh, the big kiss. I'm gonna bring this thing in here. And they have some like power whip, that'd be kind of annoying, I'm not gonna lie to you. Neither one of them gets the benefit of my Misty Terrain, which is good. Even though I don't have any status moves anymore, right? Was gone. Never mind. Calm mind feels okay here. I want to get a. I kind of want to get a darkness off to lower their special defense. But you know what? The speed boost on Feeny feels a little bit more valuable. Cause I'll get a calm mind off before the token gets an attack. Um, and then I can hit it to wither it down and this clash can beat it one-on-one. -on -one.
You know what I forget about when I use this team sometimes? Because I haven't played with this team in, a, in like weeks. I could have vote switched into my um, own Pokemon a while ago and got a weakness policy boost. But it's fine because they're going to Dazzling Gleam into me. Or Airstream. But they're going to daz Dazzling Gleam into us, please. They do Airstream, which is good, right? For them, for their speed. But which is why it's good that I did it too. Because they still don't outspeed me. Yeah, yeah. Power Whip is like the most unreliable move of all time. So because the Gyarados is what can actually hurt me, I'm just gonna um, Moonblast it. And I'll fire you, Wrath. Okay, this is perfect. Cause I'm gonna survive this. Why am I not surviving stuff I'm supposed to live? Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> That was game over for them. That was easy game over. That was so easy game over. Cause they activate the policy and I just fire you raft their next Pokemon to death, moon blast them. Oh man, come on, man. Critical hits. Oh, you know, they had screeds up still, right? I could calm mind here. I should have just moon blasted the pole. Actually, I didn't even realize that I had. I forgot I had a paralysis. Par I forgot that I had it paralyzed. Yeah, I'm not worried about muddy. You worried about muddy water? That ain't what we gonna be cooking, bub. That's why you nuzzle the Dragapult. Dragapult will be faster than my Feeny here. Like, you know, that's okay. I can actually calm mine again. <laughs> I'm gonna calm mind again. Let's get greedy. Night change these kids, get rid of some of that health. <laughs> they don't know what to hit. <laughs> they, don't, they can't. They have dr breaking swipe, which can't touch me. Reflect, but I have no physical attackers. Light screen is already up. Um, and Willow Whips is the only thing they can click. Moon Blast right here. Paint Split right here. Get me some health back off that pole. Thanks for the energy. <laughs> I laugh at your light screen.
We are just gonna ignore that Dragapult <laughs> completely. <laughs> I guess I don't really have to because actually this um. The sun is up, so I'll just do this. Uh, let me check my trickle turns. I have two, so it doesn't matter if they protect. We gonna shade them in the night, even though the sun is out. It didn't matter that Dragapult can't move there because it has no moves, right? <laughs> no damage. Eat Moonblast, son. With some amazing, uh, with hard work <laughs> and a little bit of luck, you two can look just like me. Ka chow. <laughs> oh, we're having so much fun. We're having fun. That could be the end of the video. Yeah, you know, I got some uh, cheesecake waiting for me from this place. There's this place near me where I live. Makes cheesecake. The whole neighborhood talks about them. Um, every time I walk by, they got the sold out sign. Today, they did not have the sold out sign. So I think I'm going to go enjoy some cheesecake. So you can answer that question of the day. You can like this video. Notifications. Because my videos don't always get pushed to you guys for some reason. Um, and I thank you guys for coming out and I will see you in the next one. Peace